All right, so the banded chest press. This is a great exercise for the upper body, the chest and the shoulders. And because you're doing this standing, you're gonna get some good core activation. There's really two ways you can perform this and both ways have their own benefits and, and detriment. So I'll show you the first one. First off, you wanna take your bands, you wanna anchor them on something that's pretty stable, right? So I have them anchored here on this squat rack and I have two bands. One will work fine as well, as long as you can have two handles. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get in front of it so that the bands can come here to my sides. Now, I'm gonna do the first one with a staggered stance. That means one foot is back, one foot is forward. Now, I like to press forward with my hands facing each other and my bands on the outsides of my arms. Why? Because as I press forward, I have to get a little bit of a squeeze in my chest in order to maintain tension. If my arms are like this, then the tension's kinda coming up here. And if my arms obviously are supinated, they're coming down here. But if it's at its side, it's pulling my arms apart, which actually requires more chest activation to do this press. So real tight core, bring them all the way back, keep the shoulders from shrugging, so you wanna kinda keep them down. Press forward, squeeze, and then come back real controlled. Of course, the further I step forward, the more tension there is in the bands. Now the second version is with my feet together. So instead of having a staggered stance, my feet are together. This requires more core stability because it's gonna to wanna to pull me back more. I have to brace my core a little bit more to perform the exact same exercise. Now, personally, I prefer feet together, mainly because bands aren't that heavy anyway, so it's not like I'm gonna be maxing out my chest and my shoulders, at least not for me personally. So I like to do them really slow and keep the whole body active and tense. This is the tempo that I like to use when I do a band press. Again, you notice my feet are together, core's tight. At the top of the movement, I'm really squeezing my chest. At the bottom, I'm still maintaining tension. I tend to find higher repetitions with this exercise to be more beneficial. So I like to tell people to aim for 15 to 25 slow, controlled, and squeezing reps.